What's good? It's me, J. King, a.k.a. Coach OG. Shout out to all my OGs, OHG, O-Head Gang. Shout out to my IQ Ballers and the Clamp Camp. Hey, yo, Clamp Camp, I got something for y'all. You know IQ Ballers and OGs, y'all know y'all always included. But the Clamp Camp, this one is special. We got another Clamp God on our hands. Let's go. You know the name is J. King. Royalty is always in my name. Small forward, because we continue in with the Swing Man, Wing Man series. We almost done, man. This is the number four. Hand, I'm going right-handed, because I'm right-handed. I used to be left-handed. We ain't going to talk about it, man. They forced me to be right-handed, but we're here now. We're going with number zero. You choose whatever, whatever number you choose, but I choose zero, because I got zero tolerance for you dribble guards, because I'm plucking and clamping you up all game. Let's go. Height, we going 6'7". Weight, we going 228. We ain't going to be all light in the buttocks, as my mama would say. We're going to go 7-4 on the wingspan. And you know the body shape. You know what it is. The must I say it all the time? It's the find. Because I ain't no weakling, bro. I be in the gym. I lift. Let's go. On the close shot, we're going to go 76. The driving layup, we're going to go 80. Driving dunk, we're going 85. And that will automatically put you at 35 on a standing dunk. That gives us 15 finishing badges. Now, the reason we're going 85 is because we want the pro contact. We're just trying to get at least pro contact on this. So we'll get pro contact with this. And in 84, you get the pro contact. But at 85, you get silver posterizer. I'm going to show you all that real quick. Silver posterizer at 85. So we want to get we wanted to get posterizer at silver. So that's the reason why we went 85 and pro contact. And we wanted the 80 layup. You know what I'm saying? That way that gives a good... Good option because sometimes they force you to a layup, so you might as well be able to get some finish. And we get silver fearless finisher off of that. Continuing, going to shooting now. Mid range, we're going 74. Three point, we're going 85. Free throw, we're going 73. Now, that gets you 20, 20, 20 shooting badges. That is more than enough. More than enough. You know what I'm saying? Let's go to playmaking now. We're going to go 76 on the pass accuracy. We're going to go 87 on the ball handle and 80 on the speed with ball. And then the reason why the, the main thing here is the reason why we're going 87 on the ball handle is because we want to get silver clamp breaker. So if I go one lower, as you see, in order to get gold, gold clamp breaker, I think I just said silver, but in order to get gold clamp breaker, you got to have an 87 ball handle. Well, we were going for that. We want to be able to just kind of barrel through some folks because we're going to pair that with a couple other badges that we're going to get into later. So hold up. And that gets you 20 playmaking badges. Now let's go to defense. We're going to go 70 on the interior. So we have a decent interior defense. Perimeter defense, we're going 86. You know what 86 gets you because we always aiming for it. It gets you silver clamp. Stick with me. You know what it is. We're going to go 90 on the steal. You'll get silver uh, glove and just have a high enough steel to really pluck some pockets. You know what I'm saying? We're going to be klepto out here. And we'll go 87 on the block. The reason we're going 87 on the block is because we want to get gold chase down artist, which is at 75. But once we go here, 87 gets this silver anchor. Now, I wanted to try to fight and get the 88, you know what I'm saying? I I, I, don't, I couldn't really, oh, I need to go all the way back. I couldn't really finesse it enough a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Because the height was a certain point. I tried to get the speed, and it only went up to 87. But, you know, that is what it is, bro. We're going to be good regardless. Trust me. And then we're going to go 60 on a defensive rebound. Now, speed, 85. Pretty darn good speed. Acceleration, 75. Strength, 82. Vert, we're going 70, stamina 90. Now, the reason we're going 82 on the strength, the big reason for that one, we want to be, you know what I'm saying, we define, we might as well actually play like we look, you feel me? But we want to be able to get bully on silver. I mean, if y'all consistently, those of you who consistently watch my videos, you already know what it is, bruh. Like, I, I be killing, especially y'all that watch the stream, I be killing with this silver bully at times, bro. I, I, I kind of just do what I want. You know what I'm saying? I do what I want. You know what I'm saying? Now I do what I want. Now I do what I want. Keeping it moving. Let's go. That gives you 18 defensive badges, by the way. You know what I'm saying? So let's keep it moving. 
Now I pick slash and take. I just like to, you know what I'm saying, be able to control going to the basket, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I control my shot enough. A little extra boost on the slashing kind of helps out. And then, you know, we're going to be locked down. We're locked down. Might as well play like a lockdown. Might as well with the lock take, right? But y'all can choose whatever you want. It will not affect the build name. It just affects however you play. So keeping it going. Two-way inside our creator. Now, it's not the rarest name, but it ain't too many of them out here. You know what I'm saying? You get a lot of inside-out scores, some inside-out shot creators, but you don't get a lot of two-way inside-out creators. You know what I'm saying? And Gerald Wallace, Paul, George, and OG Ananobi, though, that's some pretty good company. If y'all not, I know a lot of y'all probably know Paul George, and so y'all not probably familiar if y'all don't watch the basketball, but if you don't know who Gerald Wallace is, I encourage you to go look on YouTube and look at a video of Gerald Wallace. And OG Ananobi is the new, you know what I'm saying, a young and good little young young fella coming up, you know what I'm saying? Good defensive player as well. Good another inside out player. You know what I'm saying? Trust me, this is a very good company. It, these people definitely fit this name. Now let's go ahead and test the badges. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get y'all up out of here. Alright, so we're gonna go bully silver, of course. Uh we're gonna go post rider silver, of course. Now we're gonna go fast twitch on bronze. Uh limitless takeoff on silver. Uh we're gonna go Phyllis Finisher bronze and then go uh silver on facility finisher and then uh we could do a bronze masher. You know what I'm saying? That works. Or you can even go bronze on the uh acrobat whatever you choose to do depends on how you play of course like i said all the time you know what i'm saying these are just my suggestions just throwing it out there you know what i'm saying you, you ain't gotta do it like this it's my suggestion even to build itself you don't have to do it like i do it you know what i'm saying i'm just trying to get y'all halfway there you know what i'm saying save y'all some time i spend a lot of time to save y'all time so shooting uh we going agent three on silver off gate of course we go catch and shoot gold Mini Magician on gold, uh, guard up gold. <laughs> we going uh, Claymore gold, <laughs> all gold, everything. You hear me? Um, and then, well, that's it. That's it. You know what I'm saying? We call, we call all gold everything, like my boy Trinidad James. And then playmaking. Now we gonna go gold on the ankle breaker. We we went for it, so you got to go for it. Clamp breaker on gold, because we just going to barrel through people. But the bully badge and this right here, we're going to be unstoppable going to the paint. You know what I'm saying? So you're going to get a lot more than you think. Uh, gold, quick first step. Uh, we're going to go bronze on the hyperdrive, bronze on the bailout. And then we're going to go silver. On the unpluckable, my fast forget skip one. Then we're gonna go vice grip uh bronze as well. You know what I'm saying? You can do that right there. And then if you really feel a confident, you feel like you know what I'm saying, you, you protect the ball very well, you ain't dribbling it too much. You really, you really for real, for real, could just do that right there to get the combos together. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't if you ain't doing if you if you feel confident in your dribbling, you know what I'm saying? Either way, man, this is personally how I would do it, man. Uh them locks is going crazy, man. I, I, I would recommend putting your unpluckable. I've been playing around with the unpluckable badges, and I, I feel like silver is a good spot. You know what I'm saying? So keeping it going, going to defense. We going off the break. Of course, we going silver anchor because we went for it. You might as well go for it. You hear me? Uh, we going clamp silver, of course, bro. You know how we do. You know what I'm saying? We going glove silver, of course. Then we going, of course, we're going gold chase down. Uh, let me see here. We going to go. Gold Interceptor, and then we're going to run back over here, and we're going to go Silver Ankle Braces. Now, you could just go Ankle Braces on, on Bronze, because, I mean, people you people going to be guarding unless you just switch off as the lock. You know what I'm saying? They probably might not be doing too much, so you might be able to get away with it. You got good perimeter defense, so you could just go Bronze and then put uh, a Bronze Workhorse. Do not sleep on Workhorse, y'all. I get a lot more steals because you get... I know everybody else did got to deal with this. When you get a pluck, but you just can't get the ball. Like, that blows me so much. This workhorse, I got a guard that got workhorse on gold, and that doesn't have, ain't too many times somebody going to pick up the ball before I do. If I get the pluck, I got the steal. You know what I'm saying? I guess a couple times 2K be trying to hold a brother. You know how that go. But I'm just saying, don't sleep on workhorse. It definitely helps finishing out. And with the interceptor plays, when you tip the ball, it definitely helps with actually tipping it and actually catching it. 
you know what I'm saying, after you get the tip or, or, or just being when you get crossing the lane in the first place. Definitely helps out with that as well because at that point, it's a loose ball. So any loose ball situation, you are very likely to be able to get the ball sooner and better. So that's it, man. Uh, I hope y'all enjoy this build, man. I enjoy making these builds, man. I tell you, man, VC wasn't so high. And, you know, shoot, and pockets went a little tight, you know what I'm saying? Brother trying to pay for a wedding right now and all that, you know what I'm saying? So if I wasn't doing all that, I would be playing with every single one of these bills. I ain't going to hold you. I, I I try to be genuine about this. I ain't giving y'all no BS. Everything I give you, I will play with myself. I have tested these bills. They feel good. They they clean. They 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 cheese, bro. Like these, these bills is like that. I'm trying to tell you. So give it a chance, you know what I'm saying? At the very least, let it at least be a, a, a blueprint or a skeleton for whatever it is you're trying to do. And you can go off of this and be like, all right, I can do this, I can do that. And then maybe you might switch some stuff up on your own. Just let me at least save you some time, man. That's all I'm trying to do here, man. I appreciate y'all for coming through. I appreciate y'all for giving me a chance. We're in the early stages, and I just feel so blessed that y'all are able to, you know what I'm saying, keep boosting my spirit and allowing me to, you know, give y'all whatever... Uh, insight that i could give man so i appreciate y'all giving me a chance man y'all can listen to everybody but y'all listen to me so i appreciate it y'all know what it is man you know the message y'all have a great day great week on purpose please and remember the message remember y'all know what it is say it with me don't be toxic and let's ball never mind who you thought i was